gonna start out with the diamond prep bits. Number two, remove the entire shine off the nail. And the dry skin. That crust and molestries as we call it. Did you guys have a good weekend? What did you guys do? Let me know in the comments below. Did you do anything exciting on Sunday yesterday? Oh, well, it was your nephew's birthday, huh? Uh, it's my godson's birthday. Your godson. Yeah. What did you eat? Chicken and hot dogs. Ooh, Sonora style hot dogs? Oh, yeah. I saw that at a vegan restaurant here. They have vegan Sonoran style hot dogs, and I was like, I wonder what that tastes like. Yeah. You haven't gone? No, I can't have beans. Okay, it's the same Well, then there's nothing in the hot dog then. Well, the bacon wrapped around. It's. I think they use like rice paper, that's, and they make it um, look like bacon or something. Oh well, like the vegan. Okay. Well. Huh. Where's this place at? Uh, I have to look it up. It's on um, Grubhub, but on. Uh, Yesterday, I had Vietnamese food, but it was really oily and ugh, it made me feel really yucky. And we're really gently removing any dry non-living tissue. Bobby F. says they just did their nails for the first time with one, two, three, go, and OMG, they feel strong, as, just as strong as acrylic. Aren't they like the best thing ever? I always used to do pink and white sculpted on amber. And every once in a while we would do like a design when the nail was really grown out or when we had done already like a few backfills. Or if it was a special occasion. Mm -hmm. Like after doing like two or three backfills, the nails start looking a little funny and I was like, just do a design. So we would do a lot of like the marbles, remember? Yeah. I actually screenshot it to show somebody the other day, but uh, the marble collection. Yeah. And a long time ago when Instagram first started, you guys, if you like scroll all the way down to like the beginning of my Instagram. I used to name every single one of my sets of nails. Oh yeah, you did. Yeah. I remember one was called like Apache Tears that we did on uh -huh. you. Remember? Uh -huh. Isn't that a stone though, like an Apache Apache Tear or something like that? I don't know, but it sounds like it should be. Mm -hmm. <laughs> Do you remember Talia that used to work for me? She was Ooh. the Apache lady. Oh, that's right. Oh my gosh, you guys! You guys want to hear a funny salon story? Let me know in the comments below. Really? Anna and oh, Which one? Oh my gosh, no, I don't remember. You had a lot, but um, you always did my nails. Yes. They would do my pretty hair. <laughs> Becky. Becky. And her husband. She left him. Oh really? You remember Daryl? I remember you talking about him, but I don't remember. I don't think I ever saw him. Really? And he would sit next to her and just breathe and go... <sighs> no, see, I never saw him. Really? Where is my oh, nail prep? Ooh. Oh, what's everybody saying? Um, I'm waiting on my order. Awesome! Don't forget, you guys, you have until midnight today to use the promo code for Labor Day. Uh, different viscosities, but you can use either or. Is the press-on gel No, press-on gel is in a bottle. And DIY is in a tube. Like this one? Yes. Do you guys want to hear the funny story? What did they say? Do you guys sorry about my ouchies? <laughs> <laughs> yes, she was putting on some garments and <laughs> the garment fought back. <laughs> What's the cool love? Labor 13 for Labor Day. Oh, from Buffalo, Washington. Ah, from Washington. So we're going to use pink press on gel as the base. Max, I got the wrong products. I have Yep, that's correct. And make sure you include a picture of the items that you've got. And make sure you uh, include your order number and then a customer service agent will reply to you as soon as possible. And they want to hear the story. They want to hear the story? So Talia used to work for me. She didn't work that long. 
because um, I remember one time it was really late and I was like, why is she taking so long to do a pedicure? And it was after the salon had closed and she was still not done. And I kept hearing giggling back there. And I walked back there and there was all these cans of liquor. So her and the client were drinking as they were getting pedicures. I was furious. I was like, what's wrong? And the client was like, oh, you know, don't don't fire her, don't blame her because um, it was my idea. And I was like, no, she should know better. Good times. And then I remember too, she was like, oh, I'm gonna go to, um, what's the pastry reservation called? San Carlos. She was like, I'm gonna go to San Carlos, I'm gonna go visit, you know, so and so. And I was like, oh, okay. And then um, she took the salon's nail drill. <laughs> and I was like, uh, why did you take the salon's nail drill? And she's like, oh, I want to go do so and so's nails so I can make extra money. And I was like, okay, but why are you taking company property? <laughs> At least ask for it. Yes. So we're going to use a long sculpted coffin and I already know the size is because we did it on her other hand already. And we're going to use the Costco size of the DIY gel. And you guys, if we reach 100 views, we're going to do a giveaway. Who wants a giveaway? Let's give away a squeezy. A squeezy? Uh huh, which is uh, one of our gel to apply rhinestones. Play. Have you guys ever had any kind of salon stories like that? Those of you that work in salons where you caught a co-worker or somebody drinking on the job. Alcoholism is no joke. Yeah, somebody says stalker is like on overnight. Oh my god. Stalkers on overnight? Oh my gosh. Yeah, like, 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 I don't stalk her. Oh. Like, like, on their overnight shift. Oh. Not the kind of stalkers that you get. <laughs> <laughs> I thought, like, oh my gosh, that's really scary. Oh, drinking with the MLD, yikes. What's an MLD? Manager on duty. Oh. They're like, I need my scratchers. <laughs> you inspired Teresa Hagen to get her nail tech license. Awesome, congratulations. Super proud of you. So this shape is the long sculpted coffin. It's her nail like a glove. Are the same size? Is it the same size for all of your sheets? What do you mean? So like if I get a four and a coffin, is it the same, the same in a regular um, square? Nope. Um, they all have their different sizes, so it's important to measure them and see what's going to fit best prior to the applications. Because each nail has a different mold. We're so close, we're more than halfway there for a giveaway. Sprinkle the video in every group you can, in the swamp meat groups, in the beauty groups. Let the world know Eno Tour is live. La glory. 
¿Y esto? <risa> ah, es cierto, porque ya te escribo. What's that? <laughs> What's the something? Gina sent you 50 stars. Oh, thank you! Whoop, there it is. Did it burn? We'll just put it on low heat. There we go. Uh, different styles and different shapes. The shortest nails are the ultra mini, are the most tiny. Yeah. In bikini. Yeah. You can take it out now, dear. So a lot of people always ask, can you trim them or can you cut them? I'm gonna show you guys. With our gold tip cutters, you can. So we're just going to trim them a little bit. So that way they're just a little bit shorter. So they are fully customizable, fully trimmable, and it's not going to um, affect the durability of the nail. Side, nice and straight. Look at that shape, you guys. Stunning. Who said that? She's ready to party? Ya está lista para bailar. Hi from Kentucky. I feel like we're at like a nice like Cabana Beach Club in, in Acapulco. I tried the promo code in the last section and it worked. Do you live outside of America? Because it's working. Hi Orlando! How's it going friend? Long time no see! Hi from Hawaii! Fun music! <laughs> Have you been to Hawaii Amber? No! Are we? You? No, I always wanted to go when Beth was still alive but now she's went peace out so it's not the same. So the promo code is only valid for the U.S. because of our Labor Day. So Canada's um, has different sales and things like that. So message enocouture.com Canada, and let, um, they'll be able to further assist you with all the stuff going up up in Canada. We're gonna use a power top base. We're gonna blend in that cuticle. So I always leave a tiny little bit of space between the nail and the uh, one, two, three, go. Usually about one to two millimeters. So that way it's easier for the drill bit to go inside and blend. Ooh, there's your song, Amber. Cuatro kilo de cadera de cadera. Hi, from Pittsburgh. How beautiful the cuticle just blends you guys. Stunning. Mm -hmm. 
Really? This is jam? You have to send us a video of you dancing it. Wow, we're so close, you guys. We can do it. Then you have to pick a winner, Amber. Okay. Winner, winner, chicken dinner. You're welcome, Mark. I'm trying. Mm -hmm. Where was that coming out from? Serbia. Hi, from Serbia. I think it was from like. Panama? What's that? In Canada. Oh, I don't know. It was like from Panama. Yeah, maybe. I'm gonna go back in really gently with the diamond prep just to further refine any drying on living tissue. You know what I just realized? I remember seeing your niece. She was like this big, like tiny. Yeah. Que la llevabas. Both picked me up at the nails, yeah. Yeah. Before you know it, you'll be playing a quinceañera. Yeah, she's a quinceañera. Really? Yeah. You want to say? Yeah, she, she wants to play. Really? You want to say? I heard like anything like that, like a wedding, a sweet 16, a debutante ball, a quinceañera, that they're really expensive. Oh, is it still around? Mm -hmm. Ah, good day. So let's go in with this woody buffer and really jump in with the top shine off the nail. Tienes aquí tienes acetito rosita, acetona. Yes. Pure acetone. No, es para que se le salga cualquier producto que quede en el, la punta. So somebody asked what was in my pink duck definition. This is just straight pure acetone and it is to uh, build, remove any product build up off the bit. The code is labor 13. That is correct. All together, lower caps and 13 is the number, not uh, written out. As, oh, I'm so glad you guys can't see my legs because on Instagram everybody was like, oh my god, look, Max, he's wearing Daisy Dukes. Booty shorts. <laughs> Hot pants is what they're called. Autumn, Yaki, Comanche. Do you know any autumn amber? I do. Really? Do I know any autumn? Just one word. What? Bean eater. That's not even an autumn word. Popogo is it? Oh, okay. <laughs> That's what the Spanish is called. Yeah. Easy. It's what? Easy. Easy? Okay. So hurry up is satam. Satam. Uh, um, do you have a, like a a name in autumn or no? I. Mm -hmm. Or is it like specific names in autumn? No. No? Like runs with a horse and stuff? <laughs> no. Or like, like in another language? What do you mean? Like for example, like in Japanese, Keiko is a Japanese name? Oh. Mm -hmm. No, I don't think so. It's, what I do notice is that in Spanish, it's like the autumn culture, like a lot of uh, what would be Mexican first names are their last names. Really? So like Yeah, yeah. Jose. The last Francisco. name is Jose? Yeah. Really? Mm -hmm. Wow. Runs with a horse. Why? Well, I didn't know what you meant. Grandmother really? Willow. And uh, if I'm still alive. Really? Is he still making music? I mean, that song's always gonna pop, right? But I mean, that song came out so long ago, I wonder if it's like, it's probably hard to, um... It's like as old as I am. <laughs> <laughs> it's probably hard to, um... To top something that was so iconic. Yeah. This is a pink three. Isn't that beautiful? This color is like the perfect nude on every skin tone too. Run with 
crabs with the horse. I can't get over it. That's funny. You know, horses are not from America, right? Yes. They're uh, Arabic. Yeah. Buffy says, Happy holiday to you. She wants to get you to the promo on free shipping. Awesome. I hope you love everything. Wow, he's not that old. <laughs> that, I wonder if that's accurate. Do you remember like Banda Matches and all of them too? Yes, they were just in Phoenix. Really? Yes. Are they all old now? I don't know. I wonder if it's the original members too. Oh my, I don't know. And you remember they used to dance like the Power Rangers, like kicking with yeah. like all their friends? Uh huh. That's the only reason I would have wanted to go see them to see if they were still doing that. Probably too old now. <laughs> Can, but it's gonna clog up really easily with gel. That's why I always go in with a carbide or a ceramic bit first, and then I go back in with a diamond bit so that way I don't have any clogging. And we're gonna take some acrylic powder, we're gonna sprinkle it on top of the nails, we're gonna do an ombre on it. Actually. So make sure you coat it really nice and even because doing this is going to give you a texture to the base and it will make it so much more easier to ombre the phalange. You don't have to put a full base on full coverage nails? A full base of what? Uh, based on what though? Can you elaborate the question please? And remember when you sprinkle acrylic powder on top of the wet gel, make sure you don't do it all the way to the back. If you sprinkle it all the way where the cuticle is, you're going to have a really bad mess and it, it won't look good. Could have put that in. Show the last one. Really? Yeah. Only, I mean not even in like Mexico, but like in that in Brazil. Would they have like a lady teach children like how to count and like ABCs and all that like bikinis? Remember she would dress all provocative? Really? That's how she got famous. Yes, so we're gonna, this video is gonna be saved so you can rewatch it from the beginning to see the whole application just in case you missed anything too. So this is pur this purple is 54 from gel polish. And we're just doing a nice even coat on the free edge because we're gonna ombre this. Oh my god. Because you use that Yes, for sure. It is a essential. Oh, gel polish before sold out. In where? the color towards the back ever so gently with the pistachio now I want pistachio ice cream I love pistachio and pistachio macarons are so good too oops sorry have you ever had pistachio muffins yes from Safeway Forever and ever, till you take them off. And do a second coat of this one. Hmm. Bye bye. A second coat. Just to make sure you get a nice even application. Like that. Put the bottom. So there's no 
excess gel on the sides to keep it as skinny mini as possible. Like that. I wonder if the new Candyman movie is good. Has anybody seen it yet? Is it out already? Oh, I think it is. Yeah? Yeah, because I was like, it came out uh, uh, August 24th, and yesterday I was going through the VOD. And I was like, oh, we still have a while, and I just realized it's September. Yeah, right? So it is out. Has anybody seen it? I love scary movies, but I don't know about this one. I don't know if the original actor's in it. Not I. I don't like Really? the diamonds. So we're going to use diamond memories and we're going to use the stones. Where is the diamond memories I used? Are these that right here? Yes. No. Maybe. You want the showgirl ones? These are really big. I'm always using everything. Coming down. Try to coming down very liberally. We're going to put the diamonds and keep the diamonds all thicker in the middle. We're going to apply the bigger stones. I'm using my pinky star gel brush too, which looks like a magic wand. Have you ever tried acupuncture, Amber? Um, no. It hurts. It hurts? Let me do it again, though. Where do you do it? Here. Oh, like... No, on my back. But every time they, like, they stick the needle and I jump. Because you don't know when it's going to hit you. Watch the video and it'll explain everything step by step so that way you can see it too. So that way I don't get sidetracked with um, what we're doing now. So what we're doing now is we applied Gummy Gel and Shine and uh, Dom Top which is our new thick gel top coat. So you apply the Gummy Gel and then you have to apply the top coat directly on top in order for it to work. Okay. Bueno, me da mucho gusto. So make sure you apply the Dom Top. You float it onto the nail so that way you get the best encapsulation possible. And the ones that have the ombre on them because we want to really, really melt everything in. Really take your time and just, you know, work it in. So that way you get a really even smooth texture. But remember always two coats of top coat look best. So we're gonna do Dom Top first and then we're going to go in with Wonder Gel. Really smooth everything out. I want to know what the difference is between the Dom and the Wonder. Um, have you checked out the product description yet? So if you visit the website and you read the product description, it really goes into detail about what the difference is between both of them, and that way you can determine what's going to be best for you. 
Wonder Gel is a rubber gel top coat, and Dom Top is a thick semi hard gel top coat. So it really comes down to personal choice and what's gonna work best for you. I recommend getting all three of them so that way you have all three on hand too. So that way you can switch them out or use them interchangeably with each other depending on what you need. And always remember to focus the bigger diamonds in the middle, you guys. shows too. I remember at the casino, Willie Nelson, they always just bring him, remember? Yeah. And I think, was it you that I told her? Or, or I think it was Livy. I was like, how could you bring like that kind of people here? And she's like, all people like him. Uh -huh. You told me. Oh, it was you? Yeah. And you're like, all people like him and that's who uh, goes. Yeah. Willie Nelson on the road again. <laughs> Going places that have never been. Well, I can't wait to get on the road again. Did you ever meet any celebrities while well, you were? I have to show you what I'm driving. Oh, really? Ooh, in Phoenix or here? Here. In Phoenix, I didn't. Uh, I, I resigned after a year. And then, and then, oh my gosh. What was she like? She's cool. Really? Was she pretty in person? <laughs> when she saw you, she's like, oh my gosh, you're so pretty. Fingers. <laughs> Yikes. That sounds intense. <laughs>
Yes, whatever happened to her? <laughs> Gillette was her name? It's like a razor name. Yeah, that's what I think about. Long sculpted coffin, yes. Yeah. So let's freeze it for a few seconds. Yeah, for sure. And it's also saved on Instagram too. bigger stone so that way I don't have to put gel over the entire nail and this will also help seal in the edges of the bigger stone so that way it doesn't get tangled in her hair or in the vajas uh -huh. the spank fantasy but that'll make a really thick nail. I'm just so excited. definitely magnified, I agree. <laughs> now it is with the diamonds and everything. <laughs> and it's her birthday too, where are you gonna go? Kelly. But where? Do you have like a, like a picked up places to go already or no? Maluma, Saturday, Dodgers, Heels. Where's he gonna be at? Uh, Ontario. Ontario? Far. Where are you well, staying? She's like, it goes down to like from her wrist to her like the ankle. Just one giant spanx. <laughs> Can you imagine like one? <laughs> two people like pulling this way and two people pulling the other way to, to close it up. She probably can't even sit down. Antonia Cubino Wilson is here! Look at that, you guys. She is ready. What do you guys think? Do you love it? Love it. That ombre is so pretty how it looks airbrushed. And now you guys know how to do it too with the little hack. Let's put both for the final shot. Look at that. So beautiful. Let's do a little hard line. Oh, no worries. So you guys, that's gonna wrap it up for today's live demo. I hope you guys enjoyed this design and I hope you guys have a, had and have for the rest of the day a safe and happy Labor Day. Don't forget that promo code. You have until midnight Arizona time to use it, Labor 13. And what can I say? I love you guys so, so much. Thank you for choosing enocouture.com.